GNOME, shortly known as GNU Network Object Model Environment, which provides a graphical user interface and set of desktop applications for the Linux operating system. By the time of recording this video, GNOME 42 is the latest version, offers a modern desktop focused on delivering an intuitive user experience for all Linux users. GNOME 42 brings a ton of new features and changes, which include a system-wide theme, new applications, built-in screenshot UI, screen recorder, improved horizontal workspaces, touchpad gestures, and more. Despite being the most widely used desktop environment, only a few Linux distros offer a perfect implementation of GNOME compared to others. Hey guys, my name is KS Girl. In this video, I'm going to show the top 5 best Linux distros of 2022 that you can try, which offers a phenomenal user experience of GNOME Desktop. Let's get started. Endeavor is an excellent Arch-based Linux distribution for both beginner and advanced users. Unlike Arch, Endeavor OS provides a Calamares installer that supports both offline and online models, which lets you pre-configure the Arch Linux and install it on your computer. With the Endeavor GNOME Edition, you are getting an up-to-date GNOME Shell desktop along with useful software right out of the box. The beauty of Endeavor OS is that you are getting access to the freedom and flexibility of Arch Linux. Endeavor comes with all necessary applications and packages that users will generally install on their Arch PC. This includes basic drivers for sound, network, graphics, as well as a support. Firefox browser will be installed as a default browser for browsing the internet. One of the major life-saving features of Endeavor OS is that it comes with the non-free NVIDIA drivers preloaded into the kernel. This is super helpful for users who are using an NVIDIA GPU on their system. So installing the NVIDIA drivers is hassle-free and super easy to make work. If you are getting into Linux, then you surely must have heard about Ubuntu. It's the most popular Linux distribution. Ubuntu uses a heavily customized version of GNOME to maintain the design aesthetics of their Unity desktop. Ubuntu 22.04 is the current LTS release, which features a GNOME 42 desktop. From the start of use, Ubuntu feels like the home of the Linux operating system and it's completely designed for everyone. For newcomers, Ubuntu could be the best distribution and helps them experience the power of the Linux operating system. Compared to other GNOME distros, Ubuntu provides accent colors that look fantastic. This new feature is present under the appearance setting. Ubuntu offers 10 color shades to choose from. This time, changing the accent colors affects more than just the Yaru theme. The accent color will be applied to the folders, icons, GNOME shell, and pretty much everywhere to compensate for the overall look of user interface. You know, other than this, Ubuntu has the largest community of active users always there to help you out through your problems. Thanks to its massive popularity, almost every available Linux software provides excellent support for the distribution. Fedora offers the latest and greatest GNOME experience out of all other Linux distributions. It supports a unique ecosystem that provides users with new and updated software as soon as they are available. 
With each new release of Fedora, the development team incorporates the latest version of GNOME. This allows you to get access to all the newly released GNOME features before anyone else. However, since you are getting access to all the latest software first, there hasn't been much time to test them thoroughly. So be prepared to face the occasional bugs as new updates roll out. This is why Fedora is more suited for enthusiasts and computer geeks rather than regular users who are looking for stability. Besides that, the Fedora workstation is the only Linux distribution that provides a vanilla user experience of the GNOME desktop. Pop OS is based on Ubuntu, which is developed and maintained by System76. System76 is a Linux hardware manufacturer, primarily known for selling laptops, desktops, and servers. Pop OS was created in 2017. Since then, it has progressed a lot and become one of the best Linux distributions. Pop OS uses a Cosmic desktop, which is based on GNOME. The main goal of Cosmic is to offer a polished and more functional user experience when compared to GNOME. Now, Cosmic Desktop introduces a highly flexible dock to Pop OS that can be customized according to your liking. When pressing the super key or window key on the keyboard opens the launcher, which is used to search for any app or files. Some of the features of Pop OS include tiling windows, vertical workspaces, built-in NVIDIA drivers, and more. Overall, I would say Pop OS is one of the highly flexible and well-maintained Linux distributions which is known to be stable and secure. Zorin OS is another Ubuntu-based Linux distribution designed for new Linux comers. It comes with a heavily customized version of GNOME that allows you to switch between a Windows or Mac OS-like interface. Depending on which desktop layout you pick, it will give you a familiar GUI that closely resembles the look and feel of your old OS to make the transition as seamless as possible. Not only that, but you will also get access to Wine and play on Linux out of the box. This allows you to run Windows applications on your Linux system. For security and stability, it follows Ubuntu's long-term release cycle, so you can expect a new Zorin OS version as soon as the next long-term Ubuntu release rolls out. So if you are a beginner or new to Linux, Zorin OS will be the perfect driver for you to experience the Linux operating system.
And that's pretty much it. These are my top five lists of best Linux distros of 2022, which provides a next level user experience of GNOME desktop. What do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comment section down below. If in case you like this video, hit the thumbs up down there and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and consider hitting the bell button to get notified whenever I post a new video. Also, if in case you have any suggestions, post them in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching my video. This has been KSKRL. I will see you in my next one. I've been driving this train Years in this lane There's no stopping this flame Cause I came to the game And I changed it to play How I like rearranged it To my own domain Yeah I got what it takes Made lots of mistakes Taking shots Skipping breaks Feeling lost Feeling great Popping off Singing straight Never stop Never changed All the squad here to play And I've got something